We're diving to the deepest parts of the ocean in GTA 5 to discover places no one's ever been before. I'm looking for treasure, gold, and according to legend, a secret key which opens this hatch. It's hundreds of meters underwater and has never been opened in history. And rumor has it, somebody is inside. So this is my costume. It looks like we're going to space, but we may as well be because I've only explored about 1% of the ocean floor. And when I say discover places no one's been, I really do mean it. I've never in history gone as deep as what we're about to do today. And if you want me to do more underwater videos, I want you to smash like on this video as hard as you can because we are about to go underwater. This is gonna be awesome, dude. Say bye-bye to the sun and everyone else, Franklin. So much could go wrong down here. We could literally get a crack in the visor and that would be it. How far out do we have to walk to, uh, you know, get underwater? Here we go. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, come on. Okay, we're gonna do some running now. Come on, I wanna get underwater, finally. No, come on. Let me go underwater, dude. So we are officially underwater, only a few meters down. Life is kind of good down here. Well, actually, I don't see any life. Is there <laughs> is there any fish around? <laughs> Wait, I, don't, I actually don't see anything. Let's see if we can find um, some fish or, or anything. And by the way, I know what you're thinking. Yep, there's sharks down here. We're prepared. Don't worry. If we see a shark, we'll take him out. Just got to make sure I... Uh... Look around me. I mean, oh my days. There's one right behind me. Jeez, get away from me. Get, get away. Whoa. Yeah, we got to be careful with those. They could literally come from anywhere. Ah, oh, finally, I found some life. Check it out. There's like shoals of fish down here. Ah, oh, man, that's so cool. I'm going to see if we can do some underwater fishing. All right, stay steady. Come on, stay steady. Stay. Get him. Get him. Wait, he just disappeared. What just happened to him? <laughs> that's crazy. Wait, I think I just heard something as well. Is that a dolphin? Okay, I don't know where that came from, but I heard something above me. <laughs> All right, let's just keep moving, Franklin. I want to go even deeper than this. Wait, I think I can see something out there. Is that... Okay, something's floating around. Wait, there's a fish. I'm going to snipe the fish. Bosh. Oh, my days. I got him. <laughs> oh, wait. I broke my game. Okay, we're not supposed to snipe fish. You get a free pass today, fishies. Only because I'm not allowed to take you down. Now, which way do I go? I just want to go to the deepest part. So, I mean, any way forward, I guess. <laughs> oh, all the seaweed's getting really annoying. This coral everywhere, man. Okay, can we jump over some of this stuff? Watch out. Don't... <laughs> Don't puncture your suit. That would be a disaster. <laughs> and check it out. We're going even deeper. Guys, we're about to jump down into another deep part of the ocean. I don't even know what they do down here, but they're still fishies, so it can't be too deep. <laughs> Let's go. Whoa, this is crazy. Is that an island? Okay, I think we're looking at that island right there. So if we climb up that, we go up to an island. So let's just go this way. We'll go around them. Love that. Just a random rock sticking up from the ocean bed. <laughs> if I was a fish, I would be king of the castle. We would be up there playing games all day. Okay, I kind of want to walk up there now, actually. Come on, Franklin. We got this. Let's get to the top of this rock. This is my rock now. Check it out. This is how far we've come. That's pretty far, actually. Nice. All right, this is nowhere near the deepest part, though. Let's keep moving. Over the ridge and back down. Oh, check it out. It's an orca. No way. Do I take it out? I mean, I really want to, but the game's gonna crash. I'm not allowed to do that. This ain't my territory. Oh my days. Uh, <laughs> you know what I said I would go to the deepest part? Maybe I might be regretting that because guys, check it out. I have just come across a giant cliff. Are you kidding me? That looks terrifying. What if we run out of oxygen? <laughs> All right, let's do this. I'm going down three, two, whoa, come on. <laughs> yes. All right, we made it down in one piece. What are these things? Is that meant to be coral or like some sort of weird thing in the ocean? There's like so many of them. Ugh, they look so gross. Let me see how deep I am. Okay, now we're pretty deep. I don't even think we would swim up there in one breath, but this isn't even the deepest part. We're not even close. And now we're losing some of the coral. It's looking way more barren. Check it out. It's so flat everywhere. That's another shark. I found another guy. Is he going to do anything to me? All right, I'm gonna keep an eye on him and let him do his thing. Maybe he's just gonna look after some fish or something. I could use a rocket launcher on him. <laughs> can we use one of these on the wall? <laughs> I think we can. Oh my days. Okay, three, two, one. Yeah. Uh-oh, oh my days. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> the rocket's not moving. What? Man, everything's a bit weird underwater, isn't it? They don't move. That's crazy. Okay, we won't be using rocket launchers underwater. What if I throw a grenade? Does that... 
That's just really disappointing. <laughs> Wait a second. What if I try and pour stuff underwater? Okay, so I can pour this. That works. It doesn't just float away. What if I then try and set fire to it? Is that... Oh, jeez. Okay, right. The shark suddenly come over here now. Hey, buddy. <laughs> you can leave me alone, my guy. I was just testing some things out. So you can't use rockets and you can't make fires underwater. What else do I need to know about this place? It's so mysterious. Like, look at all of these weeds. They're so long. I would not want to get tangled up in those. We're going even deeper. Oh, my days. <laughs> Just when you thought we were already deep, we can go even deeper. We're gonna slide down. There's no other way. Franklin, start sliding, buddy. Oh, <laughs> this is so crazy. We must be going into like a trench because this goes so much further right and left. I'm gonna call this one the Mariana Trench for now. Named after the lovely Mariana sauce. <laughs> Probably not, but <laughs> it's a nice tomato sauce. These weeds are even longer down here. Like, it's a jungle. I didn't realize it was like this down here. Can I see the top? Can we? Oh, my days. I can barely see the sunlight now. <laughs> How do I even get back up there, dude? There is no way. Okay, so that's blocked off. Can we go this way? Get out of the weeds. Get out of the weeds. I need to see where I am. All right, what if we go here? Okay, we're following the trench through. Oh, it's getting real dark now. Like, seriously dark. Have we got a torch we can use? So I got this torch. It's not really doing anything. You can just about see it. So, uh, nope. Torches don't work down here. Whoa, is that like another hole? Phew. Dude, I thought I was gonna fall down something else. <laughs> this trench is getting so narrow. Where even am I right now? We're about to leave this area and go into unknown territory. So I'm pretty sure this is the deepest anyone can go. And we're about to go even deeper. I put my radar on so I can look out for sharks. It'd be kind of handy. If one pops up, we'll see a little red dot. So keep your eyes on that, guys. Just let me know in the comments if you see one. Almost there, buddy. Almost there. We oh, yo, check it out. <laughs> Wow! Whoa, is that like an egg? What is that thing? Wait, dude, that's the coolest looking rock ever. And oh my days, the sea urchins, the sea urchins! Okay, watch your foot, Franklin. We don't want to tread in any of those things. They are so spiky. Oh no, they're literally everywhere. Are you serious? I don't mind the starfish or even the little fishies. Oh, what are those? That's like the tallest ocean plants I've ever seen. Whoa. <laughs> now we really are in a jungle. I've literally lost Franklin. If we just stand like, let's say, I don't know, here, we could hide forever until the oxygen runs out. Is there anything like hiding in here? This could be like a sea monster's lair. Who knows? Let's just keep moving. I want to go to the other side. Keep following this down. We can go even deeper than this. <laughs> Check it out, guys. I have reached the edge of the ocean. No one has ever jumped down here. All right, let's do this. We're doing one quick jump. And we're sliding down. Oh, my days. Hold on to something, Franklin. Hold on to something. <laughs> Where is this going to take me? How deep does this even go? Wait a minute. That must be it. That's the deepest part of the ocean. Whoa. Oh, guys, check it out. There's like nothing on this rock anymore. I've been falling for a while and here we are. It's got to be thousands of meters down. I mean, can I even see the top of the ocean? Barely. I can just about see some sunlight. What is this place? This is insane. Hey, there's even a fish down here. I got to check them out. Hey, little fishy. <laughs> Where are you going? Are you... You, you're gonna swim into a cliff? Wait, what's this guy doing? I just want to take a look at this person. Maybe he's got a nest in the cliff or something. Swimming into the cliff. Okay, right. Not the smartest fish I know. That's a massive cliff, by the way. Like, I actually can't believe I fell down the entire cliff. <laughs> so, yeah, let's see if this goes even deeper. I want to get to the other side of this. Is there anyone out there? Anything? This place is so deserted. There's like nothing. It's just grass. Or I guess it would be moss. Yeah, we're just looking at moss right now. Whoa, whoa, whoa wait a second. Wait a minute. Oh my days. Guys, that looks like an edge to literally nothing. <laughs> What happens if I jump off this? This is why none of you, including me, can go this deep. Because suddenly you discover the abyss. And I don't know what's down there. There could be anything. Franklin's like psyching himself out right now. He knows he's jumping down there. <laughs> okay, this could be the last thing we ever do. But I gotta give it a go. Let's jump down. Three, two, one. Yeet! <laughs> Oh my days. Guys, I think we've just gone off the edge of the map. Now we're seriously falling. <laughs> so, bye bye land, I guess. 
There it goes. Bye-bye sunlight? Come on, there's got to be like an answer to all of this. This has got to take me somewhere. Th this can't just be nothing. Okay, I see something on my radar. There's a red dot. There is a shark nearby. <laughs> There's things down here. Imagine if this is where we find the sea monsters. So at this point, we may as well be in space. I don't know which way is up or down, but we're still falling. Now I've been to the deepest parts. I would love to start looking for treasure. So uh, I'll just hang around here until we see something. <laughs> How deep even are we right now? Let's see. We are over one kilometer deep in the ocean. And now we're floating around. There's no sinking now. Like, look, look at this. There is nothing around us. <laughs> It's just us in the middle of nowhere. This is insane. <laughs> Gotta hand it to you, Franklin. That was quite the adventure. Round number two, Franklin. Are you ready? Don't worry, we're not going crazy deep this time. Instead, we're looking for places like these. Underwater wreckages. There's so many of them around GTA 5, and I think I've only seen about half of them. But hidden amongst these is secret treasure, and hopefully... And this one is going to be the key to the underwater hatch. Let's see if we can find it. Do you reckon it would be... Oh my days, another shark. Another shark. <laughs> get out of here, my guy. I don't want to get eaten today. You had your chance. Anyway, as I was saying, this is a pretty big plane. It could literally be anywhere. So I'm going to check the inside first where, you know, people would be flying around and chilling. Is this a health pack? Don't mind if I do. Nice. We're beginning to find some things. There's a bunker underneath. I can't climb. Let's see if there's a way we can sneak up. Maybe we can climb up this bit. Ah, oh, what? There's nothing up here. What about behind me? Is there anything? Nah, nothing there as well. All right, there's nothing in the plane. Let's go check out around the plane. This is a proper 747. I can't believe this even crashed in the ocean. Like, how is that even possible? When did it happen and why? That must be one of the engines. Wait a second. I think I can see it. Guys, there's something over there. Yes, our first bit of treasure. <laughs> All right, keep jumping. Come on, I want to see what this is. Oh, check it out. These must be the chairs and the seats from the plane. And there's a box right here. All right, let's get this open. Two million dollars. Whoa. <laughs> okay, that's a pretty good amount of treasure to find. It's not the key we're looking for, but I'll take it. Two million dollars ain't bad. I want to get out of here now. This thing is creaking, and I feel like it's going to fall down even further. Oh, Oh my days, there's even more of it. There is literally another engine down there. <laughs> okay, let's get out of here, Franklin. There's more to see. Like this crash plane. It's another one. Except this one's a little bit smaller. And I can already see where the treasure is. <laughs> there's a couple of rumors about what this plane was, but nothing concrete. I'll let you guys just run with your imagination. This could be anyone. And that is a very big box. Is that a padlock? All right, we're gonna have to try and get this padlock open to get this box open. Ah, nice. Wait, I just got five million bucks. Oh my days, another shark. Another shark. Can you please just leave me alone? What were they doing flying with five million dollars? Very big questions which need answering. Over here is the first ever tugboat in existence. If you guys ever sailed one of these, you will know that they're not exactly the strongest in the ocean. So this looks like it's been down here for quite a while. It's pretty rusty. I mean, I don't think there's any shiny bit on this boat at all. It's still got the rope for the anchor. There's like weeds growing out of it. That must be the coil. The vent looks completely stuck in there and rusted over. And it's even got these mollusks on the side of it as well. That's insane. Whoa! <laughs> hey, come on. Don't fall through the stairs. This thing really is rotting away. Now, what if we got another box? Hey, this one looks even bigger too. How do I even get in? Come on, dude. We got to get this door open. So I made it in. We just went through the window. All right. Let's get this box open. Seven million dollars. Not bad. We're making a lot of money down here. <laughs> but I still haven't found the key. I need to find this key so I can open the hatch. Have you ever seen one of these before? An abandoned submarine. Sunken, split in half, rusted away. I mean, this has got to be like a hundred years old. It's not that far from the hatch. It's pretty big. And I've already found the treasure. All right, what have we got in here? Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Oh, man, this box is really tricky to get open. Oh, two million dollars again. Okay, that's not bad. I'll take it. We're making a fair bit of cash. After this, we might just get a little house upgrade, Franklin. How does that sound? <laughs> Maybe drive a nice little supercar or even get a nice little submarine. We're getting closer to the next location. 
You won't believe what we're about to discover. I knew about this place, and some of you guys might know about it too, but let's just say it's probably the biggest wreckage in the entire of GTA 5. All right, this is bigger than the plane we saw at the start, and I don't even want to know how this even happened. Hey, out the way, fishies. Out the way. I'm coming through, and I'm pretty sure there's some sharks behind me too. Oh my days, there's even more of them. That's not just one. Yo, we better get moving. We better get Franklin, get moving, get moving, get moving, dude. We're gonna find somewhere just a little bit out of the way where they can't get me. Uh, hide under these rocks. Hide under these rocks, Franklin. Yo, get out of my way. Get out of my way. There's so many sharks, dude. I'm not surprised, actually. Oh my goodness, there's even more of them. All right, I have not come here to get eaten by sharks. Quick, get, get down here. Get down here, Franklin. Now. <laughs> oh, jeez. You are not eating me, guys. No way. I'm gonna hide in here. Whew. All right, stay down. Stay down. I'd like to see you. Oh, my days. They're, they're getting in here. How are you doing that? Get, get out of here, bro. Seriously? All right, just for a little bit. I'm gonna stay in here and try and pick off these sharks. I'm surrounded by so many of them. I've taken out three. There's another guy. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Another one there as well. There's another one just peeping his nose. <laughs> I see you, buddy. All right, there's someone else around here. Oh, my days. There you are. Got you, my guy. <laughs> Wait, there's one behind me, too. There's another one up there. Whoa. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not that surprised that there's this many sharks here, but they all went after me. I didn't think that would happen. I thought we could sneak around them and try and hide somewhere. Well, welcome to the uh, giant shipwreck. This is what we're looking at. Believe it or not, it's only half of it. There's even more of it over there. Let's check out round here. I don't want to climb this boat. That was the last thing I want to do. I mean... There's like containers literally hanging off the side. We, we could slip and really hurt ourselves here, Franklin. Oh, yeah. Wait, we're good. We're good. It stays open. I found the treasure. That's great news. That's awesome. That's awesome. All right, I'm going to grab this. What's inside? That's a tiny box. Please be the key. Please be the key. <gasps> it's the key. We got the key. Amazing. Okay, we'll go into the hatch. <laughs> I have waited 11 years to see what's inside. And today is the day we could finally find out. All I know is the hatch is incredibly deep. And I haven't seen many sharks this deep either. So I'm just liking it. I'm getting away from here as far as I can. <laughs> and as fast as I can. I have no idea where this goes or where we even are right now. But all I know is the hatch is in this direction. Hey, look what I found. There's an entire cave down here. Isn't that? cool. <laughs> Whoa, okay, if I was living down in the ocean, I would call this place my home. These must be the remains of the sea monster. I remember seeing this, except I've never actually walked past it. <laughs> wow, it really puts into perspective how big this animal was. I mean, each spine is like the width of Franklin. That's so crazy. <laughs> and the skull? Oh, you guys wait till you see this. That is a massive skull. And these were like the fins? Yeah, this was a crazy monster. I can't I can't even believe this even once existed. Anyway, focus on the mission. We're looking for the hatch. And according to my directions, the hatch is down there. The reason why this place is so mysterious is because you can't exactly touch the hatch. You can get within arm's reach, but that's it. That's the limit you can go to in the game. But with this suit, we can go even deeper and get it unlocked. There it is. There it is. No way. <laughs> it's right there. You hear that? Oh my days. This is why I want to get inside. Someone is making a thumping sound in there. And like I said, I don't know how long it's been closed for, but I've never seen this open. Hello, is there anybody in there? No answer. Ah, uh, to be honest, I don't think they can hear me through, uh, through all of this metal. It's so thick. Right, let's see if this really is the key to open it up. You ready? Let's give it a go. Just gotta put this in here and... It is. It's the right one. It's the right one. Whoa. Guys, it's Brad's. Whoa. This is crazy. Oh my days. You even got supplies? Hey, that's a lot of supplies down here. I guess that explains how you survived down here for so long. Is that a TV? Okay, they got a TV. <laughs> this is insane. I can't believe I'm actually in the hatch. And out of all the people, I was not expecting Brad. I thought you went out in North Yankton. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, smash like and help us get to 7 million subscribers. My name is Nort, and until next time, stay awesome.